Hi, and welcome to Golf with Board. My name is Board, and I'm a Norwegian golf vlogger. In this vlog, we're gonna have what's in my bag, what's in my Callaway bag, season 2022. On my team is uh, my local uh, sponsors, and uh, Din Golf is Norway's biggest travel agency when it comes to golf, and obviously Callaway. Callaway Apparel and Callaway Golf. And in my bag, I have 15 clubs for the season. Uh, I'm changing it depending on the course, uh, but let's go through the bag. Here uh, I have my three wedges. They are all Callaway jaws. I have a standard uh, loft with 52, 56 and 60 degrees. These are, I love these, uh, they help me around the green. Uh, and on the shaft I have a Dynamic Gold 115 and the shafts are stiff. True temper shafts. All these are uh, MD5R 10S. That's it. So depending on the course, I have either two or three of these. When we go over to uh, the irons, I have Callaway Apex Pro from uh, pitching wedge to eighth iron, and I have Callaway Apex from four to seven. So it's a combo set. All the shafts are the same. Uh, the shafts I have is uh, True Temper Elevate, uh, 105 grams, extra stiff shafts. And these are beautiful. I really like these uh, irons and it's, I think it's pretty cool and my first time to try a split set. All of my irons are standard uh, loft and uh, length and lie. I haven't changed anything there. I uh, have them uh, a normal setup. From a 4-iron, uh, after that one I have a Callaway uh, Forged Utility, X-Forged. This is an uh, extra stiff shaft, Project X. And this uh, helps me a lot because uh, I'm not the best one when it comes to the next clubs. Uh, I basically want to say that I have two handicaps. So uh, this is the club that saves me uh, off the tee if I really need to hit the fairway. The next club in my bag is this. This is a bad boy. Victor Hovland actually has this in the bag. It's a Callaway Apex a utility wood. It's not a wood, it's not a hybrid, but it's utility wood. This is, uh, how many degrees is it? 21. I use it uh, into the green, off the tee, approach shots, uh, in the rough where I'm uh, where I'm usually am, uh, but this is a great club. Hazardous uh, smoke shaft, extra stiff, 80 grams. <sighs> Aye, this is beautiful. Beautiful club. Me and Victor Havel. By the way, if you're new to the channel, uh, feel free to subscribe to my channel. It doesn't cost you anything, but it would mean the world to me. The only thing you do is you hit that button right down there. I would really appreciate it. When it comes to the top of my bag, the next club is this beautiful Callaway Rogue ST. This is a ST Max D. It's a three wood, 16 degrees. And I like it because it's flat. It's not um, round as uh, some of my uh, woods have been. This club, when I hit it uh, the way I should, goes 230 until 250 meters. What a fuck! It's a beautiful club. I hit it off the tee and uh, also my approach shot uh, on a par five. Uh, the shaft here is a 10 size, 75 grams, extra stiff uh, flex. Beautiful club. Mwah. Thank you, Callaway. <laughs> the next club is uh, my driver. It's the same as my wood. It's a Callaway Roll ST. Max D. It's in a 10 and a half uh, loft. The shaft is uh, the same. It's a 10 say, 65 grams, extra stiff shafts. This is a beautiful, beautiful club. Uh, it helps me find the fairway more often than I did uh, earlier. It's uh, forgiving uh, for my uh, abilities and uh, I just love it. Uh, I just love it. Recommend this club to all the majority of golfers, uh, golf hackers out there. Beautiful, beautiful golf club. 
the last club in my bag, and maybe the most important for all of us golfers is this one. This is the putter. This is the Odyssey putter. Uh, it's uh, 35 inches long. Uh, it has a stroke lab uh, shaft, and it's a uh, Odyssey two ball 10 triple track putter. To have a summary of it, it's uh, it's really forgiving. Like I can't, I if I don't hit it center, I can hit it off the toe or off the heel. It still helps me with my length and I'm not looking as a, the bad putter that I am. So this putter is not only beautiful to watch, but it's, uh, it's so forgiving. And I, I really, really like this putter. Thank you, Callaway. We'll just uh, continue with the bag. Look at this sexy logo over here, golf with board. And obviously I'm a golf vlogger. I wouldn't want to put my name there. So uh, I put uh, my occupation or what I'm doing. So uh, like the pros, Look at this sexy bag, huh? This is a staff bag, the normal size. They are pretty rare, so I'm lucky to have one. Thank you, Callaway. Uh, if I open this big pocket here, I have uh, a water bottle. Uh, thank you, Vika Zagolv. Uh, I have some sunscreen, uh, always important. Even in Norway, look at this day. Uh, so today I would use it. And I have um, a scorecard holder. Um, so this I use if I'm playing a new course. Always nice to have. Except for that, I try not to have too much in my golf bag. So over here I have my valuables. Um, I have a laser that I use a bit. Uh, but I also have a uh, watch from uh, Garmin that uh, helps me with the length, uh, how long is it to carry the bunker and so on. I always have my towel. This is obviously a Callaway Rogue ST towel. Um, my tip there is just to wet the one end of the towel. So when you're out on the course, it's easy to just wipe off your clubs and you can uh, have the dry side to use afterwards. We'll continue with my bag. We also have here Langman sticks uh, with the Golf with Board logo. Uh, a friend of mine made this. Thank you, Halvar. You can do a lot of stuff with your uh, alignment stick. It's really up to you, but I recommend having them in your bag. I have an umbrella, obviously, for rainy days that we have a lot in Norway. I have some rain clothes, jacket, uh, rain pants. Obviously, I live in Norway, so I, I need that. And these are also are with my logo on. All my sponsors, thank you to them. I can't say it enough, but I, I really, really appreciate it. If you flip around this staff bag, yeah, in the front I have a pocket here that I use my phone and stuff um, to have inside, so that's empty. Inside the next pocket, I have a pair of rain gloves, really important, especially in Norway because it rains a lot. And I also have this poach here from Oslo Golf Club that uh, Steven Nui gave me. Thank you. Inside here, I have um, some dry shampoo that I use to see where on the club face I, I hit. I have this to mark my ball, put a line on it. Uh, that the line I use uh, not only on the green when I'm putting, but also off the tee to see where I want to aim. And uh, I, I try to do as Paul Blakey says, aim small, miss small. <laughs> I also have uh, one of these to use on the range. Except for that, uh, what's inside, I have some money. I also have a ball marker. Uh, I have this to clean my clubs uh, in between shots. I always ha have my green fork uh, to uh, fix the divots on the green when I'm lucky enough to, to land on the green. And I have these uh, two different colors from Stapy that I mark my ball with, uh, with my name. Except for that, I have um, in my front pocket, I have a lot of Callaway golf balls. How many? Uh, around 10 or 12, a dozen. Uh, because uh, on this course at Vinas, uh, for instance, uh, if you hit a bad uh, tee shot, uh, you have to do a Pobosulovsky golf ball afterwards. Uh, because it's hard to find the ball here in the rough, as you can see. Except for that, uh, the last thing I have is I have this little bad boy hair that I made, my grandmother made me, uh, uh, with my tees, uh, different tees, different heights, easy, accessible, and this one. 
to have music on the course is just perfect and it's a great tip that I have for you to make it more social and more, more fun out on the course. So that's what I have in my golf bag for season 2022. Hope you liked the video, thank you for watching. If you did uh, like the video and you haven't already, feel free to subscribe to my channel. The only thing you do is to hit that uh, button down there. It doesn't cost you anything, but it would mean the world to me. Have a great day, have a good season. I know you'll enjoy, this is golf with board. Yes indeed, never seen nothing like this before.